What's up guys, Saeed there. In this video, I'll be showing you as how to enable your hidden settings on your iPhone 5S. As you can see, I am having an iPhone 5S and uh, you know that mobile substrate hasn't been updated to uh, for the iPhone 5S so you won't be able to download the tweak that you want to download on your iPhone 5S. I'll be showing you step by step procedure as uh, how to make the uh, hidden settings onto your iPhone 5S. Do remember that the volume buttons after installing this uh, method the volume buttons it won't work so you have to just press the volume up button uh, up button to access your volume controls and you can control the volume right from your uh, your springboard settings so you have to bear with this uh, type of uh, settings so do also remember that if you break your device if your device is stuck at the boot loop you can just uh, put your device in the, into the DFU mode and you can restore your device easily so don't worry about that but do remember that uh, if anything goes wrong your device will be uh, breaked so uh, do follow my instructions and I'll be also providing the link of the website as to follow the instructions step by step and in, in an easy manner so without further ado let's get on with the video so I'll be providing each and every file in the description. Do check my description, uh, the video's description to see the which file you have to download. So the first thing you need to do is you have, you have to jailbreak your device and you have to install iFile and also uh, you have to install some of the files onto your desktop. So after installing the iFile from Syria, you go into your Syria and download the file that I'll be typing right now. Download this file AFC to ADD. After downloading the file, uh, you, you you have to reboot your device as uh, your device will be rebooted. And after downloading the file, what you need to do is you have to connect your device to the computer, and uh, also you have to download I file that I'll be listing uh, in the video's description. Do check it out. Do download the I file from there. So now you have to install iPhone box onto your computer and also the two files that I'll be providing in the description to download those files and keep it onto your desktop for your easy access of the files. So open iPhone box and uh, just as you can see my iPhone 5 is connected. Just click on open then go to raw file system and from here you have to go into systems, library and uh, private frameworks as, as you can see a uh, private frameworks. Now after going into private frameworks you have to create a new folder by the name as uh, prototype tools dot frameworks remember prototype p capital and tools t capital dot framework f should be in small letter so you have to do as as said in the video or your device will be pricked so I have already created the folder here as I'll be showing you right now uh, as you can see prototype tools dot framework as you can see I'll be just zooming it a little bit so you can see a prototype tools dot framework so now what you need to do is you have to uh, click right click it and open it and uh, as you can see I have already copied the prototype tools that I have already downloaded onto my desktop as you can see here uh, as you can see the prototype tools uh, just uh, drag it and uh, copy it onto your iPhone box so it, it uh, after copying it to your iPhone bo fun box just refresh it now go again back and then click on raw file system the second thing you have to do is you have to go into your library and uh, mobile substrate if a mobile substrate isn't available just create a new folder again and do remember to keep M capital and S capital uh, by doing so then you have to go into your mobile substrate folder and dynamic libraries to create a folder if it's not there dynamic d capital libraries l capital just create it click on open and copy the ios 7 uh, apple uh, internal dialib just uh, drag it to the folder will be done now after doing all this process uh, the main thing starts uh, onto your i device as i'll be showing you right now just disconnect the cable i'll be showing you right now So 
so after copying your files the two files from your computer onto your iPhone onto your phone what you do is you have to go into first into i file and then you have to uh, go into var mobile library and preferences uh, var mobile library and then preferences preferences now here you have to uh, find the file as com.apple.springboard.plist as I'm showing you right now as you can see here com.apple.springboard.plist after finding it just tap tap on it and remember to click the second option property list viewer and here the main thing starts what you need to do is you have to add and uh, a line uh, like lb prototype settings enable for that what you what you need to do is click on this plus option here and uh, type as sb uh, prototype settings pro to type settings uh, sorry prototype prototype settings s should be capital settings and e should be capital enabled and after doing this you have to select the type as the boot clean as you can see right now as the same thing should be applied and then just click on create as I have already created here and uh, as you can see sb sb as you can see I have already created it then this you have to enable it after doing this you have to enable this uh, SB prototype settings enable now what you need to do is you have to again go into your system library and launch demons as I'll be showing you right now just click on done and uh, go into your system uh, libraries and launch demons then again you have to find the com.apple.springboard playlist as you can see uh, com.apple.springboard.playlist then again do the same thing property just viewer and here there are two process you have to do the first one is that you have to add and uh, uh, line as call as environment variables e capital and v environment variables and then do the type as uh, dictionary and after this click on create as I have already create, created it so after creating environment variables and uh, t keeping the type as sting this go into it and as you can see here yeah, this uh, the, the thing appears here what you need to do is you have to click on this plus sign and remember to add the d uh, d y d y l d underscore insert underscore uh, libraries and keep this type as string and then click on create after creating it you will be seeing this uh, uh, this option here as you can see then just go into it and I'll be leaving the link uh, as the website to copy the same thing remember when you come to uh, I'll be just showing you right now when you come here to iOS 7 I O I O I O S seven. Remember, I should be capital. Uh, I should be in small letter and O S in uh, capital letters and seven. And uh, then I'll be just giving you in the description so that you might understand better. And after doing this, just click on done, and you'll be uh, good to go. So after doing this, uh, everything is uh, done, and you need to reboot your device, and uh, then you can enable your SB settings on your iPhone 5s without installing any tweak. So hope this uh, helped you guys, and if you have any problem, just uh, go.
the website that I'm providing uh, just go in there and you can just uh, uh, read step by step processes so that you might get a clear view of what you are doing onto your device so if you guys like my video find my video please do come and subscribe hit the like button and do follow me on Facebook Twitter Instagram till then I'll be seeing you in my next video